What's good, Raider Nation? Today, I want to talk to you guys about Mike Mayock and the Raiders meeting with Josh Allen and Quinnen Williams. If you guys have not heard the news, uh, on Thursday night, Mike Mayock had dinner with Josh Allen, the pass rusher from Kentucky. That's fantastic. Uh, for the most part, uh, teams that meet with players usually end up drafting them, uh, unless it's some sort of smokescreen, um, like the Cardinals meeting with Kyler Murray and then trading out of that pick. Uh, or like last year, the Raiders meeting with some of the quarterback prospects and then trading back with the Cardinals, right? Uh, obviously, that was used as a smokescreen. This year, the Raiders had met with um, uh, Kyler Murray and Dwayne Haskins during the uh, combine process. But I think that's more of a smokescreen rather than the Raiders actually going to draft those guys. Mike Mayock met with um, with Josh Allen. He had dinner with him last, uh, Thursday night, which is last night. They also, um, they've also already uh, had, um, they've also already reached out to Quinn Williams, and they've already told him they want to bring him to the Bay Area. Uh, next month, he'll be coming in, and uh, he'll have a meeting with both the Niners and the Raiders on separate days, but it'll be the same trip, right? It'll be next month. That's very exciting to me because, um, you know, again, most of the time you meet with the player, you end up drafting those players, right? Uh, last year, the Raiders, and, and it's, it's, there's a limited number of people you can meet with. So you can't just meet with every player in the draft, right? I think it's like 20 or 25 players uh, can come in for visits. Now, obviously with Dwayne Haskins and Kyler Murray, that was a combine interview. So that's not the same as a visit. Um, Quinn Williams, on the other hand, is coming in for a visit. So that's way different, right? Um, last year, the Raiders had P.J. Hoff. Arden Key and Maurice Hurst all come in for a visit. Now, it's three players out of the 20 or 25 players you're allowed to bring in. And they ended up drafting those guys, you know. So, it's exciting because um, even though I don't think the Raiders need a defensive tackle, uh, if they were to take Quinn and Williams, I would not be mad about it because he's still going to be a very good player. Uh, yeah, the Raiders already have P.J. Hall, Maurice Hurst, Eddie Vanderdose, who's probably just going to be a, a rotational player. Um, yeah, they re-signed Jonathan Hankins. They re-signed they signed Jelly last year. Um, you can always switch to a three-four front, right? Or someone like PJ Hall, or even maybe Quinn and Williams could play defensive end. Uh, PJ Hall in college played a uh, three-four outside linebacker. You know, like seventy percent of the time his senior season. So I think it's something that the Raiders could do, right? They could switch to a 3-4 or play a 4-3 with a PJ or a Quinnen lined up at defensive end. I'd be excited if the Raiders got Quinnen. Now, on the other hand, Josh Allen, I'd be even more excited if we got Josh Allen, right? I personally think if those either of those two guys fall to the fourth, most likely the Raiders will take those players. But I think they would prefer Josh Allen first because uh, he's a pure pass rusher, and that's exactly what the Raiders need. Uh, but it's it'll be interesting kind of see you know what happens between those two guys. Um, I want to know what you guys think. Do you guys think business actually translate into players being drafted? Um, do you guys not think that that happens? Uh, comment below. Please like, share, comment, subscribe. I look forward to hearing what you guys say. Um, I do read all the comments, and I really appreciate all all of you guys always commenting on my videos. Uh, please like, share, comment, and I'll see you guys next time with the Game Film Breakdown.